G'day! Welcome to the Nerdy Dad channel. Ahsoka is an imperfect, but still very entertaining dive into the mythic and mystical side of Star Wars. It also gave us some fantastic and fantastical moments, which, in my opinion, are some of the best in that galaxy far, far away. Number five, Ahsoka to the rescue. At the end of Dreams and Madness, Ezra and Sabine looked like they were in just a little bit of trouble. Even as powerful in the Force as Ezra is, and as capable a warrior as Sabine is, there didn't look to be a way out. Even Ezra's silver tongue wasn't getting them out of their bind. Wait, wait, wait! They needed something to shake things up a bit. And that something was Ahsoka. Number four, Jailbreak. Our introduction to the series and our introduction to Bale and Skull and Shin Hati. This is the scene I remember most from the trailers, and it was even more awesome in its entirety. Not Sith, and definitely no longer Jedi, these mercenaries are powerful and ruthless, and Lucasfilm came out of the gate with one of the best scenes in the series. Number 3. Night Troopers Rise When I did my Impact Points video for the finale, I didn't have this in as number one. And maybe it didn't have the most impacts in terms of the story. But this is a top five moments video. And this one is here just for the cool factor. Night Sister Magic. Undead Stormtroopers. And this isn't a book or a game or even animation. Some of the most fantastical elements of Star Wars have finally made it into live action. Number two. Thrawn's introduction. I haven't just been waiting for this since Rebels. I've been waiting for this since I first read Heir to the Empire back in the 90s. There's always a bit of truth in legends. We finally get to see Grand Admiral Thrawn in the flesh. He's no force user. He isn't fueled by anger. The brilliant strategist and art aficionado is here to wreak havoc across the New Republic, just as he did in Legends. Number one, the Ryloth campaign. Despite another three episodes airing afterwards, I could very, very easily have three scenes from Shadow Warrior as my numbers one, two, and three. All the stuff in the world between worlds was sublime. Ahsoka confronting her master, the siege of Mandalore, and... What I've settled on is my favourite moment of the series, the flashback to the Ryloth campaign. Even though we already knew it, it's this scene that makes it really sink in that Ahsoka is a child in a war zone, and all of the horror and tragedy that that entails. That's my top five moments from the Ahsoka series. Let me know yours down in the comments.